Hi guys, so welcome to my first ever YouTube channel. I am here to talk about all things fashion, from luxury handbags, shoes, clothing, and everywhere from not paying retail. Um, we don't, I don't pay retail, I thrift. I shop at clearance stores like Nordstrom Rack, Name and Last Call, TJ Maxx, but um, yeah, so today, we are talking about purse confessions and kind of a bag rebuild. So today, my mom and I just got back from even last call. Our SA, our sales associate, called us two days ago and told us about two beautiful new bags that came in. And I'm so excited to show you guys these great deals. So one of these bags, well, let me just show you. We got a Bottega Vanilla. They are both. Botana bags and one of these bags is on back order back order until October of this year. So I don't know when my last call got this bag is beyond me, but I'm so so excited to show you what are in these cute little dust bags. So like I said, I'm gonna do a bag reveal and kind of show tell you my um first reaction towards the bag and what to think and all that good stuff. Almost like a bag review too. First confessions. So first, gently get this beauty out. She's very delicate. That is one thing I will note. This is our first lambskin bag. So it is very, very, you can tell, hopefully you know what you know. You know Bottega, you see this little chain, you know. It is the padded chain cassette bag. That's where she is. In black with the gold hardware. And it's, she's, I mean, she's beautiful. When our sales associate texted us pictures, I knew at first glance that we were going to get this bag. There was no second thought because you know, obviously at even last call, everything's on sale. So this bag, we didn't pay retail. This bag retails for $4,100. Last time I looked, that is what this bag retailed for. So, yeah, she is. There is the top handle and the crossbody. There's the crossbody. Padded everywhere from back to front to both sides. And you how she opens so you just kind of pull down and up that's how she releases she's not magnetic or um, just like a snap closure or a twist she is basically you just pull down up and show you close up it says we'll take a banana right there and you see how it slides back into a slug and then there's a little more of the gold hardware so yes as you can tell Every part of this bag is lambskin. The interior is lambskin. It is the same material everywhere on this bag. On the other, one interior zip pouch, so that is nice. The one thing that I will be getting is a purse organizer, so probably just get a black one. But I will try to link what I can below. I think they're on Amazon for ten dollars, so and they look very nice. They're um, I think a felt or a suede. I'm not for sure, but I will link that below. Which ones I will be getting for these two bags, because since this is leather, you don't want your lipstick or your lotion spilling onto this leather because it will it will damage the bag. And paying this kind of money, you don't want your bag damaged at all, because that would that would make me very sad. So yeah. I mean, like I said, first glance, it is a beautiful bag, and I know everyone's first question is, is, is it heavy? Honestly, when I was reading reviews, I did. Everyone said it was heavy, or it hurt their shoulders, you know, and I was, like, prepared for the worst, okay? You know, honestly, it's, it's not that bad. So, I mean, it's quality. You don't want some cheap, for paying for this, you don't want a cheap chain, and it just looks... Oh, this looks cheap. You're paying for quality, and this is quality. This is what you're getting. So, I mean, honestly, it's not that bad. I, I think it's fine. Yes, it is 
heavy. I mean, it's not lightweight, but it's not, in my opinion, breaking your shoulder heavy. I mean, we're not going to put too much in here except for your essentials, like your wallet, your phone, your car keys, lip gloss, all those kind of goods. Hand sanitizer, mask. So, yeah, I just... That's not that bad. For me, I will probably wear it as a crossbody more than a top handle because that's just my style. But either way, with that organic drapey chain look on it, it's just is this classy, beautiful bag. So yeah. So I will tell you again, this retails for four thousand nine hundred dollars, and we paid like nineteen hundred. So great deal because we all know this bag does not go on sale and if it does it's only a couple hundred dollars down from retail value so here she is and again it is sold out most retailers and on Neiman's website this black with the gold hardware is on back order until September October I believe so yeah here she is um, I probably will put some style photos on my Instagram so if you want to see some photos like that check out my Insta it's Jada Leanne I Post daily outfit photos and find our goodies are fine. So yeah, here she is again in her glory. And if you guys have any questions or comments or need want any other information, leave a comment below and I will answer. So lay her down. Okay. So next bag is a very lightweight bag. It's another crossbody. And it is another cassette bag. So it's not padded and it's not another chain. It's just their, there's a lot of cassette bags. I didn't realize that. So this is just their typical, oh, wrong way, their typical cassette bag. And then this one is in the color seagrass. So it's a very good mix of green and yellow. It's not too yellow, not too green. Very happy with the color. I do love Bottega's like the Bottega green, like what you see on the dust bag. I really do love that green, but you know, this one is great. It looks good with black actually. So yeah, let's go into this one. So this bag starting off has no hardware besides these two buttons for the adjustable strap and they are silver. Yeah, so yeah, no hardware. Obviously makes the bag super light, Bottega's V, little triangle, typical logo is on both sides, both sides, and they are stitched. So yeah, woven again everywhere, back, front, bottom, and on the inside. So we will be getting a bag organizer for this one. I'm thinking getting the famous Bottega green to put inside this. I think that would be a good color combo together. You have to let me know what you guys think in the comments. So that's my. That's my thought. So this one is just a magnetic closure. You see, super easy. Um, again, leather on the inside, one interior pocket. This has silver hardware. Yeah, this bag is a little smaller than the cassette, the chain cassette, obviously because that one is padded. This one is not, so just a little smaller. I mean, not too bad, but yeah. Great, I love the color. It's a great size. It's gonna fit everything that I need, phone, wallet, all the good essentials. So yeah, I was so excited that these two bags came into Neiman last call and or I say call this because these are just such great deals. I don't I would never pay retail for these bags as much as I love bags. I just it's hard for me to to do that so we are lucky that we have a wonderful sales associate that reaches out to us and communicates with us and helps us get get great deals and you know when she knows she knows that we are thankful for her and everything so okay back to the bag this bag the tag says it retails for two thousand a hundred dollars i wasn't for sure if that's what it retails for now but we get this one for 900 even so yeah I'm pretty happy with both our purchases. Um, really can't go wrong. These are great colors. This one is a fashion fun color, but I really think it can really go into all seasons, unlike 
you know, some other colors or fabrics, but you know, it's each their own, but I'm really loving these two bags. Again, I will probably style this with some outfits on my Instagram, so check that out. So, yeah, first confession, first two bags and two new bags that we got today. So, other thing, if you guys could choose, which one would you get? Seagrass cassette, typical cassette, or the chain Patrick cassette bag? Honestly, it's such a hard choice. This one's probably more, I'd probably say this one more than the green one just because it's just such a statement. You can just wear this in athletic clothes or just a casual outfit and this bag just dresses your whole outfit up. You don't even have to wear any jewelry. This, this is your jewelry right here. I mean, honestly, it is. It's a big jewelry necklace, a big gold necklace. So yeah, I'm so excited, it's so fun. And yeah, that's really all I have for today. But um, please subscribe. Follow me on Instagram to see daily outfit posts and leave a comment below. Just let me know what you guys think and what you guys would like to see more of. I know this is only my first video, so there is going to be more. So yeah, thanks for watching and just to show you what the purses look like on me. I am 5'5", five, 5'6", five, five, hits right on my hip. Love her easy to get in and out of so, yeah. great okay i'm gonna show you the chain one here she is she has a crossbody get the chain on the front she works great honestly and again it's not it's not too heavy um, I'm very pleased with how heavy it is. Not too light, not too heavy. I'm okay. Mm, it was already open, but let's see. Can hold it. Yeah. And again, pull down and up. Easy in and out. Once you learn how to open it pretty easily, it's not that bad. Let me just show you top handle. Again, this is not how I would wear it, but super cute. And if you wear it like this, it is. The chain is straight so effortlessly and organically. It's just a great bag. So yeah, there was styled. I'll have more styled whole outfit photo on Insta. So yeah. Thanks for watching and looking at these beauties. I love them so much and so thankful. But yeah, I mean, I have nothing but good things to say about these bags. I really don't see any cons, unless if you want to nitpick. Lambskin, it's kind of like Chanel. Chanel's lambskin, you want to be, you want to be more careful, but it's hard when you, you don't want to baby your bag. You want to wear it. You want to show people that you got this bag and it's awesome. And, you know, some people might not like the heaviness, so that might be a con for someone else. But for me, it's quality. So I think it's a pro. So I think it's, it's great and it's not too small. It fits everything. So 10 out of 10 for me. This one, again, 10 out of 10. This one has the easier access. This one, not for sure if it's lambskin, it is a softer leather. I guess you want to be careful with color transfer, even if you're wearing jeans or anything, you don't want anything rubbing off, but again, 10 out of 10, and this one's even lighter weight, so I mean, you know, perfect if you don't want to bulk your bag. So, nothing but good things, great quality. I love both pieces. Definitely, if you want to splurge on a bag, I would. And honestly, these are great bags to splurge on. Again, for me, I got a great deal sharing it with you that you are able to find these deals if you just go out and find them. Nordstrom Rack, I mean, the last call. TJ Maxx has kind of been iffy for me here lately, but we've been really killing it at Neiman and Nordstrom. So, yeah. 
get out there and get those deals because they are out there to be found.